Welcome to the Numerology and Astrology for April 13th, 2022. If you add all those numbers together, you get the number 14. And if you add the 1 and the 4 together, you get the number 5. The number 5 is Chiron, an asteroid that represents the wounded healer teacher. It is the number that helps us to learn through our mistakes and the pains of life. The only way we can actually help another is to have walked our own path and through that journey learn what matters and what can turn the tide of terrible moments into grace and wisdom. Today is not the day to perpetuate any old lies or patterns of deception. It is time to come clean. We may notice that we are feeling trapped by our circumstances in life and begin to see certain things and events repeating. When this number is working against its normal flow, one will feel trapped by the events unfolding, confused as to what to do next. Stubbornness and resistance will not support what needs addressing. Change is the only constant in the universe and every one of us will be asked to do things that will challenge our sensibilities and the persona of who we are and who we are now becoming. Pain is often used as a tool to point out the obvious. Misery can force us to address what we do not want to see. Patience is learned when we can accept our own limitations at certain moments in our lives. If we can accept what is happening in our reality, it is easier to allow others to shift and change also. The Astrology Today The moon forces us to address the truth in the current personal reality. With the moon in practical and realistic Virgo, look at the events unfolding with the mothers of the world. They have been our guiding force throughout our lives, but, they are, but there are those moments when we have to stop and recognize the energetic shifts that are happening in their world at this time. Aging is a real thing, and that process can be graceful for some and very difficult for others. This Virgo moon takes us to that place where we learn to become the guiding force for those in our life that are aging and that need our help and support. Approach all things with an open heart and a sincere direction to be of service for them to make as many choices as they can while they can. But that, but that will allow all of us to be prepared and we have to have plans and backup plans should things go awry. Venus in the sun will semi-square and it will allow for us to go overboard on the journey to be helpful but also to elicit cooperation that is mutually respectful. We are more sensitive to the imbalances that are arising and we want to address them with a certain care that allows for relationships to deepen. There will be those that struggle to do what they have done before and that can make us feel out of alignment with our old reality while a new one is already forming or in place. Getting the mind to cooperate with the shift happening at this time is extremely difficult and we are learning to be decisive and kind in the face of discontent and change. There are solutions to the present dilemmas, but they may not be what we thought or what we want, but they will have to do regardless. Notice the needs and address them. Notice where there is procrastination happening and allow the internal resistance to fall away. Grace from, comes from accepting the moment, not from trying to keep a hold of who and what we have been in the past. Thanks, everyone.